Reef. How's everybody doing? Hope you guys are doing pretty good. Yes, sir, we're back at the damn fish tank once again. Ladies and gentlemen, look at the look at these corals. These corals are just loving life. Look at these mushrooms I gotta try I'm trying to grow them on this side here. Oh man, the letters back here, oh you know, man, they're loving it back here. Look at my hammerhead. My hammerhead just man, he's just going he's like on steroids. On steroids, and there is my other hammerhead right back there. That's the forehead back there. He's loving life. He's getting big out there. Yes, sir. He's getting big. We had him for over a month, and look, he's growing. He's growing out good. And look at this hammerhead right here. Oh my God, this guy's like an umbrella. He's puffing like an umbrella. How do you like that? Unreal. Hope you guys are doing pretty good. I know it's been a long time since my last video, but the hell's going wrong with this guy, man? Oh, man, okay. I thought, man, there's something wrong with this guy. I don't know, what, what the hell is he doing? Hope he has no egg. This guy, something wrong with this guy. Oh man, every time I put a video on, there's something up. All right, the blue hippo, he's luckily he's he's all right. Oh man, let's put a scare in me right there for a second. You know, we just checked the chemicals. Um, we checked the. Uh, oh man, this guy. Oh man, what's wrong with this guy here? I don't know folks, we put on, I put on this video and there's something wrong with the blue hippo. We checked, we tested the water yesterday, everything was, or a couple days ago, everything checked out good. Everything was fine in this tank. But this hippo, I don't know what's wrong with this hippo. I really don't. I, we gotta keep eyeing that guy there. This is amazing. My temperature is set. My temperature is at 77 in this tank. Oh man, folks, I put this long time no see, and I see this in right, right off the bat. The hippo. Something wrong with the hippo here. But I think he's fine. When we when I get done shooting this video. So I'm back. The nitrate's a little high. I'm at 12.7 ppm. So I added some um, nitrate reducer in the tank. And I'm thinking maybe that's why this guy might be unhappy. But he looks happy. Everybody's swimming around. We got a batch of water. Do a water change in this tank. Probably within an hour. Um, just topping off this batch. We could do uh, probably... Um, Probably half, half, half a get half a half a tank would change. So what I did, I just cleaned up all the filters and hair and everything else. I cleaned up because the nitrate's high. Usually I'm running around five ppm, six ppm. I know, folks. You guys tell me 12, 12.7 ppm is that high? It's not high for the corals, but it's high for my fishes. Um, these blue tanks, they don't like high nitrates like this. So. I'm trying to lower my nitrates nice and slow right now, so hopefully they can stabilize. We do a water change within an hour, but but but, but, but folks, everybody else is doing fine in this tank. See my corals, they're all happy in here. This coral, oh man, look at this flower, this is blooming, this flower pot, it's loving it. And everybody's happy, everybody's loving this tank, except the blue hipper. Here is the blue hippo, he's, he's all healthy, he's back. Swimming around, he's hiding. You see, he's just out there, probably eating some. Um, who knows what? But we're gonna do a water change of the tank within an hour. 
to make sure everybody's happy. That Blue Hippo, he seems like to be, I don't know, maybe he's just playing games. You know, this guy likes playing games a lot. But you can see he's healthy, swimming around. We'll keep a close eye on him just in case, folks, just in case. I know it's been a long time, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a long time. I've been a busy guy. Busy guy. All right, I'm going to do videos. We're going to break down this tank. We're going to break down this tank and move this tank um, to a new place. No, folks, I didn't buy. I didn't buy a house yet. Market's too crazy for houses. It's not a good time to buy a house. So if you guys are looking to buy a house, wait to after um, after election. Wait to after election when everybody comes, everything comes down. Housing market, economy, the whole nine yards coming down. But I'm waiting to next year, folks. I'm waiting to next year. But we gotta move this tank because the place I'm in right now, we gotta get out of here. But yeah, we're going to move this tank into a different location. So we're, we're going to do a breakdown on this tank in a week, week and a half. I'm going to videotape for you guys how we break it down and everything else. And how I might, you know, how I'll keep these corals, you know, hopefully still alive when we do the, tr when we do the move, um, the tank move, when we start moving the tank. But um, it's going to be a video, it'll be a lot of videos on how I'm going to break down this tank. Already late and gentlemen, but you see everybody's doing fine. And um, I'm, we're going to have several videos on the tank breakdown. We got a lot breaking down here, a lot going on here, folks. A lot going on. Um, so hopefully, everybody, when we do this tank relocation, hopefully, everybody lives to it. But, ladies and gents, I was just doing, I always came up, I just. I decided to come do a quick video because I know I miss you guys. It's been a long time no see. But we'll be back with several videos on the on the moving of this fish tank, this 90 gallon fish tank. Moving this 90 gallon fish tank. Alright folks. And we'll keep it we're gonna keep an eye on the hippo here. We'll keep a close eye on the hippo. I don't know what is the Alright folks, please like, subscribe, and have a great day.